Hey guys and girls, and thank you for watching another episode of the Xbox Tester. My name is Maurice. Today we're getting a look at Lunacy Saint Roads on the Xbox Series X. Let's get into it. First of all, let's see how much data this game is. And that's only 6.2 GB. The game's not on Game Pass, and it's like... 20 euros, I think that's a really fair price for this game. Um, the game's fully optimized for new gen consoles. Xbox Gen 9, Gen Scarlet, and uh, you know what, let's go start it up. You guys, if you like this kind of content, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. It means a lot for me, you're really helping out the channel. You can also hit the bell icon. I upload almost on a yeah, daily basis, new games, old games, updates on games, and sometimes even a little bit of hardware here and there. Big, big, big shout out to the people at Iceberg Entertainment for sending me a key to this game so I could try it out on my channel. And um, yeah, it's actually quite a fun game to check out because <clears throat> first of all, it runs incredibly well. Second of all, it also looks really well and it even has um a 120 hertz mode so if you put off v-sync the game will try to get upwards to 120 fps with screen tearing if you leave it on you get a really gorgeous stable 60 fps and um yeah i did a frame rate test on both i will start the game first continue game so it's like a horror survival game but it's more horror than survival this is definitely what you call a um walking simulator horror um story with puzzles and stuff there's not a lot of shooting or action in it it's uh yeah more the whole entourage and 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 what's going on in this game and personally love that but yeah i did a frame rate test i will show it to you right now oh is it did you put the frame rate test Maurice? here we go so yeah you can off the bat you can already see um with v-sync on you get a super nice stable 60 fps uh with uh no screen tearing that drop right there was a little bit strange i don't but with uh, V-Sync off, you get a 120 FPS, but with frame drops, with a lot of screen tearing, because every white line you see is the two screens tearing to uh, to each other. So yeah, there's a lot of screen tearing. If you don't don't if there are people that don't care about that, so I do think it's a good thing they put in like um, the the the. Yeah, that you can can at least choose between uh, 120 FPS mode or a 60 FPS mode. If you don't matter, don't mind to have some screen tearing, hey, go for it. I'm just, uh, what what am I playing on? Oh, normal. And I do think it's a really cool game. Uh oh, what's this? Ah, thank God, it's a finger. Whew. Hey. I had an X that could act like that. You know, you were in a room, and then the next moment she was also in a room with the crazy eyes. What are you doing here? <laughs> uh, uh. <clears throat> There's a reason, it's my ex. I still cry sometimes. Just kidding, just kidding. I 
I do love the game. I do think it's uh, Unreal Engine 4. Still. But they heavily, they're heavily using uh, some some things from the Unreal Engine um, 5. But look at this. And those, those. Oh, I'm, I'm, I think it's for a smaller game from a, a smaller team. This is a gorgeous game to look at, you know, if you walk outside. This is not a bad looking game. Look at this. And that for 20 bucks. That's some good stuff. And a stable 60 FPS, even a 120 FPS mode. With a game like this. I'm it's really good. It's not a long game. Oh, here she is again. And she's gone. Yeah. You know what I hate? There's one thing I really, really hate. If there's like baby voices. Like the Goo Goo Gaga stuff. Uh, I'm out when that happens. I really don't like when the Goo Goo Gaga stuff... Oh, here. Another ring. <clears throat> we are like in a basement. I think it was like Resident Evil Village or something. You were like in a basement or in like a well or something. And there was like... Indents on both the ring not a fan. and they're worn around the edges. Definitely not a fan. I think it looks really good. A surprise game for me because you know I got it and I was like eh, I don't know am I gonna like this eh, maybe maybe not there are already so many of these games but yeah this this one actually surprised me It looks good. It has some good, uh, good little jump scares. Stay, stay there. Stay there. Okay. I do think I know where to. stuff the story is cool the price is cool the graphics are cool because i really thought there was no don't throw things at me stupid ghost don't like it when you do that Yeah, you guys, this is Lunacy St. Rhodes on the Xbox Series X. And uh, yeah, this is a yeah, an amazing Halloween game for this year. This is definitely in my, uh, my top 10 
Halloween games of 2024. 100%. Maybe even top three. Thank you for watching. Hope you had fun. Hope to see you guys soon in another one. <laughs> Bye.